My realization of making this film is that the reality doesn't have happy endings. It's not a fairy tale. It's and it's very sad. It's not a film about football. It's a film that talks about very universal issues. For example, how racism destroy a team or a society from within. It's an issue that you can find it everywhere in every country. It's about Israeli football club. It's called Beitar Jerusalem. It's a Jewish-oriented football club, and it's the only football club in the Premier in, in the Israeli Premier League that has never signed an Arab player. So the owner, and he's a Russian oligarch, decides to bring two Muslim players from Chechnya to join the club. And the fans starting the most racist campaign that ever seen in Israel against this move. <laughs> So till today, Beitar is, is the club of the right wing of Israel. And every politician from, from the right wing knows that the way to the Israeli parliament goes through Teddy Stadium. So till today it's very, very connected. And that's why we can see um, all the heads of Israel are coming to the, game, to the matches of Beitar and uh, kind of using it as a political tool uh, to promote themselves. Конечно, я думал, что будет реакция. А зачем она нужна была? Ну, именно, чтобы вот подчеркнуть, показать обществу, какое оно, конечно. Рика, не макаду лазе, леса дает! Я реши! Это история в Бейтар Иерушалай. Молодые Бейтар Иерушалай, махшаб, ночи мэт Теди. I want that every person that will leave the theater will say to himself, my son or my daughter has to watch this film. Because I think that our hope as a society is the next generation. And I think this story tells on a great way how racism and how these feelings are destroying us. <laughs> 